when hell freezes over. So I'm just walking by. Thought of this expression because, well, it's cold. If you say when hell freezes over, it basically means you don't think it's ever going to happen. For example, politicians will tell the truth when hell freezes over. They're probably never going to tell the truth. My brother said he'd let me drive his car when hell freezes over. In other words, he'll never let me drive his car. I think I'll be a good singer when hell freezes over. I don't think I'll ever be a good singer. It still won't stop me. So, my name's Ronan, and I'll be a good singer when hell freezes over. What will you be good at when hell freezes over? Let me know. To twist a person's arm. If you twist a person's arm, you convince them to do something. Maybe you didn't want to do it, and then somebody told you how good it was, so you decided to do it. Well, that person twisted your arm. For example, my friend Jerry, you can't twist his arm. Once he makes a decision, that's it. He's not changing his mind. Oh my God, why did I let John twist my arm into drinking six shots of tequila? That was a bad mistake. Now I'm hungover. So, to twist a person's arm is to convince them to do something. Check out my examples. Can you make any of your own examples with the phrase to twist your arm? Up in the air. So, I was meant to leave this place this morning, but uh, it snowed a lot, like 20 centimeters a lot. So now my plans are up in the air. I have no idea what's going to happen. If your plans are up in the air, if your plans go up in the air, it means you have no idea what's going to happen because they changed, because something else like the weather happened. So right now, my plans to go home are up in the air. I might leave tonight, I might leave tomorrow. Heck, I might just leave next year, who knows? Up in the air to not know what's going to happen. To stab a person in the back. If you stab a person in the back, you betray their trust. You do something very bad to them. For example, the company outsourcing 700 jobs to a foreign country was a stab in the back to the local workers who made the business. If a person stabs you in the back, don't trust them ever again. I told John a secret and he told every single person he could. He stabbed me in the back. Guys, check out my examples. Can you make your own example with stab in the back? Let me know.